One thing you might find yourself at is at a job fair. And job fairs are where you have uh, lots of employers, usually like, let's say, in a convention center or something, and there's a whole bunch of tables with all these different types of, of uh, companies, and they have people usually from human resources, and they're hiring or at least talking to folks. And it's kind of like speed dating, where it's a real brief encounter. So you go up to the table, you tell them your name, and you, they talk to you a little bit about the company and, and a little bit about the positions that might be open and available. The idea behind these is really a way for the company to promote themselves. It's a way for the company to be active in the community. So sometimes it's a little bit more for show for the company, but a lot of times also they're looking to hire and hire for specific positions. And they'll tell you what kind of positions they're hiring for or you know what the opportunities are. And you want to ask that, hey, what type of opportunities do you have here? I know a lot about your company, or maybe you don't know a lot about the company. Just say, hey, I'm, I do this. I'm interested in engineering or I'm interested in computer science, whatever it is. What types of positions you have for that? And let me tell you about myself. And the idea is they're real brief encounters and they'll give you kind of information on that. And if anything, it's very much like a screening interview where you know, they'll ask you a couple of basic questions, see if you're qualified, and they might even, uh, you know, best case, schedule an interview for you or at least get your name to get back in touch with you. Uh, most times they'll actually just refer you to the website. They'll say, hey, go on our website, submit your application. That's how we do it. But if you're really an outstanding candidate and you're a hot property, they might even have a hiring manager there at the fair or somebody who's ready to talk to you right now and that's the best case you really want to strive for that and start talking to some kind of real people about the real jobs but many times job fairs can be real disappointing for the job seeker because you know they're not really specific they're not you know you know it's more of a luck of the draw but it's a good thing to certainly try and doesn't hurt as far as talking and learning about companies and it's a great way to learn about companies but a hot candidate they'll talk to them in great detail right on the spot but one thing you could also do when you're at a job fair is try to find out who the contact person is at the company at the booth that you're talking to to saying, well, I'm interested in this field, I'm interested in sales, or I'm interested in engineering, whatever it might be, you know, who would be the person I should talk to about that? It's a great way to get some contact information, then reach out to that person and say, hey, I talked to Tom or Jane at the job fair, she said I should contact you about these types of positions. It's a great way to kind of get started and get an in with it. Uh, lastly, when you're at a job fair, make sure you're leaving your resume or CV or all your contact information. They'll put notes on there or take notes about you. If you can fill out an application right there, go ahead. But also collect like the business cards and information from the people at the job fair in case you maybe try to follow up with somebody else and they don't get back to you, you can always follow up with the job fair person. It's another way that doesn't hurt as far as your interview search. But job interviews and the job fair, real short, more discussion, if anything, more screening-like. And it's all more about the job search than a full-fledged interview, but it can actually really lead to a full one-on-one -on -one interview, which is great and gets you off and started with this particular company.